I want to know who's your favorite person you've ever interviewed. Oh boy, I've interviewed over maybe almost 60,000 people. So it's impossible to pick out. You can go from seven presidents to Frank Sinatra to Martin Luther King and Marlon Brando. Oh, there's too many. Okay, so there's not one which stands out more than more than oh, the other. Can't, how can you pick out one? It's impossible when you've done that many people in that many walks of life. Okay, yeah, I understand. Um, so, Pert Kate, have you ever been in trouble for something you've not done? That's a very good question. Yeah, I've been. A, I've never been in trouble. I never, but I've never been. I've, let me see. I've had a few women accuse me of things I never did. <laughs> Uh, but I think that's a terrible... I think the worst thing in the world, I would imagine, is to be in jail for something you didn't do. I, I've interviewed people who've gotten out of prison who didn't do what they were charged, and been freed by the Innocence Project. And I would imagine that would be the worst thing in the world, to be in prison for something you didn't do, to be persecuted for your for your faith or for the color of your skin or your religion or your sexual preference. That has to be incredibly, when you think what this country has come through, that the United States of America should ever be intolerant of everyone, it's terrible. If you could create one law, say you, say you had the chance to change or create one law, what would it be? I would take away the designated hitter in baseball. You don't know what I'm talking about. But I like the old-fashioned baseball. I don't like the DH. Baseball fans will understand. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you very much.